Mother of two, Shukur Muhammad has brought her malnourished two-year-old son to the local hospital in Oromia's Borona zone. He is malnourished due to drought. We do not have the milk to give him. He is now surviving because of the supplementary feeding he gets from the clinic. Shukur says her entire family is surviving on food aid after they lost all their cows to the worst drought to hit the Horn of Africa in decades. The UN's World Food Program says half a million livestock have starved to death in southern Ethiopia, while nearly six million people are facing hunger. <laughs> Borna Health officials say they have registered more than 125,000 cases of child malnutrition in just the past few months. We set aside this room for malnourished children. We are keeping some in the outpatient department because we are now at capacity. Medicine in some areas is running low and despite health officials appealing to humanitarian agencies in the area, their efforts were of no avail. There is a huge gap regarding medicine. We have been appealing for help but get no response. Aid agency Action Against Hunger is helping the region's health facilities to treat malnourished children, but says the ongoing drought is a challenge. The problem is now getting tougher. All concerned bodies should provide more help for the communities living in this area. But with attention focused elsewhere, Southern Ethiopia's most vulnerable are left struggling to survive with little assistance. Over 700,000 people have been internally displaced inside the Romania region due to insecurity in areas where there are rebel fighting and intercommunal violence. Regional authorities say they are trying to meet the needs of half a million civilians who are forced to leave their homes. Galbo David for VO News, Borna Zone, Ethiopia.